everybody, it's Jackie and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be something, doing something a little bit different than I would have normally done here on the channel. I've been seeing this going around a lot lately since the new book came out. And I'm going to be ranking the Harry Potter books. So these are all my, in my personal opinion, my, I'm going to be from my least favorite to my favorite in the series. Now I'm not including The Cursed Child in this on this because I have not read it yet. Um, but I'm hoping to read it soon. Um, so yes, I'm going to be ranking them from last place to first place. And I love all these books equally. These are just my personal opinions, like I said. And, uh, yeah. So they've... And seventh place, in my personal opinion, is The Chamber of Secrets. This is book two, obviously. And, um, I love this book too, but... To be honest, it's not that my favorite only because it, nothing really happens in it until the very end. So that is why it's in seventh place. In sixth place is Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix. So this is book five. And now this would be higher up on my list if it hadn't been for Umbridge. <laughs> Umbridge just killed it for me. Um, but otherwise I liked it anyways. Um, I liked everything about it besides Umbridge. And it would be higher up on my list if it wasn't for Umbridge. In fifth place is Harry Potter and the or uh, the Prisoner of Azkaban. This is book three. Um, this is my other copy of it. I have another one that goes along with the rest of the set. Um, yeah, I just, not my favorite, but not my least favorite either. It's just kind of in the middle for me, but I still really enjoyed it. In fourth place, we have Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows, book seven. The last book in the series before The Cursed Child. And it's only fourth place because... Ugh, oh, the ending. Just the ending in general. Just, I love it anyways. <laughs> in third place we have Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stones, which is obviously book one in the series. Um, this is in third place because it's just kicked off the entire series. It's pretty much changed my life um, from the moment I started reading it. Um, and yes. In second place we have Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire, book four. Yes, I love everything about this book as much as number one. However, this has just, the book in number one, it just has a slight advantage over it. I'll talk about that in a second. And, um, but again, I loved everything about it. The movie adapt adaptation, along with all the rest of the books, is fantastic. Um, so it's probably my second favorite compared to the number one as well. So, yes, that's number two. And number one, as you, if you guys can already guess, is book six in the series, Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince. Yes, book six. I just, oh, I love this book so much. Love it, love it, love it. I think it's fantastic. Again, my favorite book in the series. It has changed my life. I remember seeing, seeing the trailer for the movie adaptation for this one. It was the first one I had ever seen out of any of these books. And I just wanted, I remember watching it, I'm like, I want to see that right now because it looked really fantastic. Obviously, I hadn't read the book, so I could, didn't go see it. But, oh my gosh, I love this book so much. And, uh, just love it. I love every one of these books. Uh, so that is all going to have for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below if you haven't already. I will have all my social media links down in the description box below. So I have Twitter, Instagram, and Goodreads. And they will all be linked, like I said, in the description box below. Along with my website, which I do almost all my reviews on before I have them up here on the channel. So that will also be linked in the description box below. And I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. I will see you guys on Monday. And I hope you have... Have a great day. So I'll see you soon, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.